we will be doing some bourbon hunting on this road trip. So we're road tripping and bourbon tipping. Hmm. I don't know if that really makes any sense, but I'll, it rhymes. I guess it works then. <laughs> get settled yep. and then we'll go start spoiling him when we get back okay we're here at our favorite liquor store MC's liquor in close to Knoxville Tennessee and uh, so as we're making our way to Vegas we'll be doing some bourbon hunting on this road trip so we're road tripping and bourbon tipping. I don't know if that really makes any sense, but I'll, it rhymes. I guess it works then. <laughs> Distiller Select Woodford. Alright, so we we may be getting that. And then a sour malt. Single malt. I'm not real big on single malts, but uh, we'll see. George Deco 15. <laughs> Castle and Key. Where is it? That looks pretty good, but you know, I have not heard great stuff, so I'm gonna. I'm gonna pass until I get to try some. Need some yeah. No, we're just uh, we're just doing a video and probably gonna pick up a couple bottles. Oh, okay. <laughs> Thank, you. Thank you. Oh look, Tina, here's a Winter Jack. Spiced apple punch. Oh wow, well, that's probably good. Mm. Cindy. When we come back with Derek and Cindy, Cindy, we'll have to pick that up. Yes. Oh my. We got that. I didn't know it was different. Here's Yellowstone. Yellowstone bourbon. <coughs> That's a hand selected barrel right here. Uh -huh. This is a. Uh, Good price. Yeah. yeah. 54. Four years. Hmm. Cool. Oh, that's nice. Uh, single barrel to select. That's cool. But I think I've got that. Can Almost positive. Oh, here's another <coughs> purse that Lance Stab got me. Uh -huh. 
like yeah. this, but it's called bivouac. Yeah, it's a little different than what you mm -hmm. There's some more Yellowstone. Up there, they got an Armagnac cask fittest old elk. I don't know about that. And then there's a Jefferson's Reserve Twin Oak. They don't have the prices on those higher shelves. That's actually, well, we, we've seen a little bit better prices at the moment. There's all your smoke wagon. They'll have plenty of that in Vegas. Oh, I've heard this is good. This is going to be on the drop. Campfire. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Oh my gosh, there's a Nile Creek 18 right there, Tina. Oh, yeah. Uh, that's so like 70. Oh my gosh. That, this is hard. To... <laughs> Courtney and Matthew got, have, gave me a bottle. I picked up a bottle mm. uh, in, somewhere, maybe here. And then we picked up a bottle at the distillery and we had uh, Eddie Russell sign it. Jimmy. No, we had it. Was it Jimmy? Jimmy. We had, yeah, Jimmy Russell sign it. And this is for, you know, for 70 bucks. This, this is my favorite whiskey. Nothing has scored higher. Damn. He's getting us the lucky seven. So I've been looking at that for a while. So we're going to try. And the other day we had some lucky sevens on the. Yeah. I do have the barrel. Uh -huh. It's in the Aneo Tequila Barrel. It's $39. Finished in Aneo it's Tequila Barrel. It's $39. How about that? Oh. It's a really good taste. Is it good? Smooth, yeah. You like that? Yeah. <laughs> Smooth and it's good. This right, one's digital. <laughs> Just the one piece. We are going to try that. Okay. Just the one piece. If yeah, we yeah. don't like can it, you, can I just hold the wild, wild turkey barrel? I just want <laughs> to hold it. I just want to hold it. This is, oh, look at that. How? This is like a... Called Wild Turkey Voyage. That's a master's key. Oh, it's finished in rum cask. And very nice. Very nice. Thank you. So, like I told him, I said, if we're going to Vegas, if we hit a jackpot, we'll uh, stop by. That's, that's why we're getting the Lucky Seven. Yes. Lucky Seven. Yes. Bob is uh, going to show us. Give us a little sip of the SB House barrel strength. And how much did you say the SB House was again? Yeah, so 129. Yeah, it's 129. It's a barrel strength. Washington Reserve. We have to make that alcohol in it already. It smells sweet. Sweet, sweet smell. Smooth and it's really good. Okay. The mixes will be. All right. you, did you try it? Did you smell it? That does smell good. It smells very sweet. Hmm. Wow, that is, that's is that's actually good. It's got some heat up front, but then it's sweet. It gets really sweet. This one is new. First time my owner is giving me this bottle. Wow. This bottle is not good in Okay. This is awesome. Uh -huh. This is good. Now, this is really so good. on the way back, we're gonna. If you still have some, I'm gonna get that. <coughs> All right, guys. This is gonna be good. Thank you, Bob. Thank you. Thank you. See you again. Yes, guys. We love MC's liquor. We got some some really cool stuff. Look at this. First of all, Bob showed us this. This is a very unique. He said it's a Jack Daniels Distillery Series. It's 
Tennessee whiskey it finished in Anejo tequila barrels. I don't know about all that, but we're gonna try it. We're gonna see what it's all about, <laughs> I reckon. <laughs> all right, so we got the Jack Daniels Bonded Rye, which I've heard is very, very good. So we're gonna try that out. So that'll be cool. Bob said he likes it. Yep, so <laughs> we're gonna try that out. And last, but not least, Lucky Seven. I, was it Nathan that had this? Nathan is on I, our live stream. I think probably so. Yeah, or was it Dice? I can't remember. <laughs> so remember. somebody said it was pretty good stuff. Remind us, guys. <laughs> so we did pick up. It might be Dice. It could be. And uh, I know he said he liked some of it. This is uh, age six years the proprietor lucky seven the proprietor so that See, ought to be that interesting is. it's got 118.6 proof so that's gonna be a little some heat i think we'll uh need to sip on this a little bit before we go play the slots yeah in vegas <laughs> uh i'm a little concerned about these birds if you've ever seen the movie the birds i, I i did when i was a little little kid mom and dad said no i couldn't watch it because it was too scary or whatever, but I mean, this it's happening right now. We're at Pea Vine Wine and Spirits. We're gonna go in and see what they got. Cousin they do got a what? Cousin Pea Vine. Yep. <laughs> and they got a cool old truck right here. Go herd. It's a cool store. How are you doing? Good, how are you? Good. You guys need help with anything? We're just looking for the bourbon. Looking oh, for you got to the right place. Anything oh, yeah, you need. Just don't ask for blankets. Well, yeah. I don't know. I'm <laughs> well, how much right. is your Knob Creek 18? Okay. And how about the Voyage? That Wild Turkey Voyage. Which one? Wild Turkey Voyage. Four ninety nine. Four ninety nine. Well, that's. Not bad. It's a hundred dollars cheaper than the last one. Oh, uh, yeah. it's the same price. It's the same price. <laughs> it says it's Let's a one seven five though. Yeah. I think I did it correctly. Here's another these restoration rise. Now that restoration rye is very good taste. That's a store pick. We, uh, ah. Mason and uh, uh, somebody else had the pleasure of going to pick that one. Do you mind being on the camera? Oh, yeah, wait, wait. wait. <laughs> You're, You're fine. fine. You're fine. Why huh? are we doing that? <laughs> <laughs> I like Mason, that even better. Okay, this is a uh, sister store of MC's uh, liquors, and they have a lot of the same store picks. And the, and the prices are same too there's a store pick bullet single barrel honey yeah. they didn't have that at the other that store and that is really good stuff and, uh, we may have to get that uh, my my bottle of single barrel store pick is pretty much done so it'd be nice to have another one let's see if they have anything else that's different never seen red line. oh yeah Ooh, 
there's a Woodford Masters collection. I wanted to, but I did. So he's Oh, and there's a cigar blend. Oh my gosh. Uh-huh. We gotta ask about those. Yeah. That's two they didn't have at the other store. Yeah. So let's ask about those. Okay, so the Magnus is two ninety nine and the Woodford is reserved, which is a master's collection, is also two ninety nine. And uh hmm, mm -mm. I don't know if I can pull the trigger on that. Again, jackpot. After we win our jackpot. Yeah, exactly. And uh, Heaven Hill, that's a, this is a great bottle. This is good. What is it? This. It was, it was good. But it's not as good as that uh, bullet single barrel. Okay, I had one of my viewers that said, get the old Overholt 114, because I had picked up the uh, old Overholt bonded, and this is a 114 proof straight rye whiskey, and it's on sale for 32, so we're gonna pick that up. Okay, so it says, all of their employees blind tasted this, and what does that say? I can't read what it says. <laughs> This one, next level, pick one up while they last. So yeah, we're gonna pick one up. <laughs> All right. So, this was a good pick at Peavines. And uh, so we got the Bullet Single Barrel, which I already know is amazing stuff I, I mean, that's one of my favorite whiskeys of all time and uh, so let me open up the car so we got old overholt 114 proof straight rye whiskey one of my viewers said hey because he saw the old overholt that i picked up the bonded and he said hey if you ever see the 114 pick it up well i see it and i'm picking it up Then I had to get this. This is one of my favorite bourbons ever. It's a single barrel store pick. And I lost the tag. Peavine Wine and Spirits. And they used, I, I read about that in there. All the, the employees tried it and they loved it. So that's awesome. And agreed it was next level. Yes. <laughs> yes. All right. On the road. We're almost there. All right. So uh, we are at Old Fort. Not Old Fart. I know y'all think I'm an old fart, but it's really, <laughs> this is Old Fort liquor and wine. And it's like, what, a mile or less than from our motel here mm -hmm. in Murfreesboro, Tennessee. Yeah. yeah. And who told us to come here? That would be our friend Dave, Lots Creek Dave, and BB. His wife, BB. Yeah. So he said, hey, you might want to go check this out. And uh, I just dropped my phone. It's all good. <laughs> so, Anyway, uh, so this will be the third liquor store we've hit up yeah. today, and 
it looks pretty darn cool. So we're gonna go in here. We're gonna find something really good. Come on in. <laughs> For a minute, I thought maybe we had the birthday bourbon from from Old Forester. <laughs> oh, it's town. New That's Will. That we got that. Yeah. Looks like the I Dream of Genie bottle. <laughs> Man, this place is huge. That's a really good price on that and I'm green. Mm -hmm. Which I have. <laughs> so let's look for some bourbon. I believe all the bourbon's down this way. That's the Knob Creek Rye. And, oh, there's that Clyde made single barrel. Man, he's got a lot of stuff. Not heard of four branches. Oh yeah. Oh that I saw that in uh, one of the other stores. Nashville Barrel. But look at this. Look at this bottle. My gosh. That must be like uh, an MGP. Let's see. Is he peach? says it's made in okay. Florida. Hmm. Oh wow, it's made in Newport Ritchie, Florida and my grandma lived, used to live in Newport Ritchie, Florida. That's crazy. Of course that bottle would scare her. <laughs> Whiskey of the year. George Dickel, aged eight years. That's the whiskey of the year. There's an uncle nearest. They have some really good prices. Here's a single barrel select. There's the bonded rye we just picked up. What else I got? You got all your knob creeks. That's that four branches. Never heard of that. If you've ever tried four branches, let me know what you think. Then maybe next time I pass through, I'll come pick it up. That's not a C923, is it? A122. Oh my God, that's like over a year old. That's almost two years old now. A122. That's that's actually a very good bottle. We have that. Always <laughs> looking, but no C923. Bell me. If you like rye that's really, 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 really peppery, you'd like the emerald rye. This stuff right here, this blue run high rye bourbon at 89, that's a good price and that is a really good bottle. Look at this, buffalo chip. Never heard of that. Heaven's Door 10 year. There's a Heaven's Door cast drink single barrel, 60 bucks. That's not bad. Store pick. Ooh, Old Fort Store pick, single barrel. Interesting. I just picked up Sagamore. Oh, wow. Here's the, this is the one. RD1. 
finished in oak and maple barrels. Wow. I had one of my viewers when I did the uh, video up at uh, in um, gosh, what's the town right across from Cincinnati, Newport, and the uh, party source. He said, you just passed up the RD1. I don't think that's the, the RD1 that he was talking about because that sounds pretty interesting, but double finished in oak and maple barrels. That's pretty cool. I, they've got a really good selection. I see a lot of stuff that I like, but um, I'm just not feeling anything I guess because I've already bought like five bottles today and uh, I'm really looking for Elijah Craig C923 or Larceny C923 that's what I'm looking for if I can find something like that then I'll pull the trigger and that is a hot Hill 5499 if you guys haven't tried the Heaven Hill Bottled and Bond, that's good stuff. We're gonna wrap it up. It's been a long day. We got to see our grandbaby this morning. And wasn't that yeah. just... It made my day. It made the whole rest of my life. <laughs> it made, yes, it made my year. Um, hadn't, hadn't been that happy since my own kids were born. So. But this is a little special, isn't it? Yes. And now we're going to go get something to eat. We're going to go to bed, and we will see you next time. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Well, Miss Holly, what can I get for you today? Hey, can I get uh, two corn dogs, two tater tots, and two Diet Cokes? Is that right, Kane? No, that's it. I don't have that right off, but... Thank you.